Hi to all. Today I will try to um, explain the new feature of uh, Trackly Studio is uh, the uh, automatic uh, titling uh, feature. Uh, the function, uh, this feature uh, can be activated um, using this uh, toggle button. Uh, if you activate this button, the feature is on. Uh, to deactivate it, uh, you can push uh, um, a second time to the, bo in, to the button. And uh, you will be disable the feature. What it does? Uh, we start uh, disabling this feature and loading uh, our uh, media folder to make a uh, playlist. I have the automatic uh, um, expect ratio on and the automatic make a track switch on. So I will have uh, all of my movie uh, automatically automatically recites and also all my uh, sorry I, I, I had to close the window and uh, also uh, I will have um, a track made made for uh, each uh, movie and music uh, uh, present in the folder. So let's get the uh, my uh, music and movie folder. Okay, uh, now that uh, I have my pl a playlist, my mu music and uh, my movies, uh, my music. There is no picture and no text because uh, it's uh, uh, the folder import uh, uh, function we used. So um, let's see. Double clicking on a uh, source started. We have uh, uh, the duration, and uh, we can skip uh, through the track to see if all was correctly loaded. Let's hear some sound. Okay, and preview. Okay. Okay, now that now that we now that we uh, have loaded our playlist, we can begin to put uh, uh, our layout uh, for example the logo our TV logo so I can use a pre-made pre make logo, logo like pirate we we uh, choose a layer and uh, layer one because all movies and music uh, are lay at layer zero uh, we play the logo okay let's reduce its size I like like that uh, and opacity less opacity okay I like in this way S the position the position Okay, I got I got my logo. Uh, let's see a little more bigger. Okay, I got my logo. Now that I got my logo, I can uh, uh, I have to um, to fix uh, his position, uh, his layer, um, and uh, all the uh, modification I made uh, through all the tracks. Because in, in uh, this mm, very moment, if I change track, uh, my modification will be lost. Mm, to um, fix the modification permanently, I have to select my source. S uh, I have to be sure that the select source are the one I want to um, I want to modify. I go to track option and I can copy state and settings of the source through all the tracks. Now that I copy my source settings, I can 
skip to another track my logo will be here in all the tracks if you see the pirate is on all the movie okay now I uh, I also wanted to put uh, um, a, a timer uh, a, an overlay text timer uh, so I add a text I switch it uh, to a timer mode I use the playlist mode switch and I choose another layer all right I have my timer too big yeah it's too big so the first things I do is to resize the 8 all right and let's uh, 5 pixel from above ok I want uh, a background and I want the background to be 50 opacity and then I can squish ok squish ok I like this like this I like it no this is what uh, I want ok I take a look if I like it seems to be good if uh, uh, the same uh, um, the same um, mm, the same thing happen if I switch the track uh, without saving the state of my modify modifi modify source so uh, I have to uh, before change track uh, be sure to save my change changes using the copy state and set it because I want this timer through all the tracks okay it is copied now if I switch to other tracks the timer will automatically automatically get the playlist uh, time it depends on the video the time change all right this is a way to uh, make the playlist but uh, if you want also to do um, titling uh, to put uh, an overlay text uh, uh, that indicate something for your current video you can do this using uh, adding a, a, a another text putting some uh, some text using the layer okay another layer of course and uh, um, positioning and resizing this text and put where you want for example here okay in this way I got this one I have to uh, I can do uh, the same operation but I will have TS uh, in this case uh, the content of my text will be replicated through all my tracks and so I will have to modify uh, by hand uh, all the uh, title is that uh, for uh, because I, I I decided to you uh, to um, introduce this new feature so um, let's use it I have uh, at this very moment uh, you cannot uh, titling uh, uh, already loaded tracks I will uh, make it in the future uh, for sure mm, and now I, I mm, at this very moment uh, um, the auto titling function will uh, um, cover only the new loaded uh, uh, movies or mm, music so let's start uh, stop all the streams we make a new studio we activate the automatic make text overlay title and we uh, load our 
folder. Uh, what you notice is that uh, all the videos will be loaded and music and also the track are made the video uh, are correctly recited and also a new text uh, a new text stream named titles uh, is automatically making made it if you uh, begin to play you will notice that on each track uh, automatic uh, the name of the file is automatically make as an overlay text for each track okay now that I have my text uh, I can modify it for example if I go to see Tears of Steel. Let's see. Okay. And it's too big uh, for for titling, so I will make it more like that. Alright. Yeah. I will make changes like the capital remove this uh, this uh, and this okay and uh, let's say mm, I want the position at bottom and also I want uh, oh, and also I want a background uh, green colored no a background uh, blue colored hmm. and a uh, 50 opacity percent okay this is what I um, I like it yeah I quite like I, I want the text in orange and I want to change the want to change the okay the um, the font okay I I got it I like it now I wanna uh, to uh, make uh, let's say 30 and this one is better oh. okay now I like it in this way I uh, want to make it uh, mm, permanent to all my titles so I go to I be sure that the selected source is title I go to track option I don't use the first button because uh, tears of steel will be duplicated to all tracks I use the third one that copy only the style and position okay now that I copy this if I go through my tracks I will see my title in the customized way to all my tracks automatically w if I want to make uh, local changes to the titles uh, I have to modify the titles itself and uh, once I, I have satisfied I have to update uh, the current track so I am in the correct track I I make my changes and now I updated the track. Perfect. If I didn't uh, update the track, I will be I will lost uh, my modification. This is okay. This one I don't want to make changes because uh, this one I want to remove. Okay. Uh, this one yes. This one I want to make the changes uh, only. Okay remove the mp4 and update the track this one this one will remove this okay and update the track and so on and so on I will change all 
auto overlay titles this okay like that I like it update and so on then I can put uh, naturally um, a timer if I want on layer 2 as we can as we uh, see before like that and uh, put a rectangle 50 opacity and then squeeze the tag all right uh, so be sure the text one okay text one is my counter and all copy to all let's see perfect okay now i want to put a logo so i, I had add pirate uh, layer 3 all right let's play it all right and we put and put the layer the one here Opacity two, and voila. Okay, then I have my videos with my logos, with my timer, and with my overlay title setup. Now I can broadcast to what I want using the FMA. That's If you, uh, in this case, in this case, if you have the, this button um, selected and you add a folder or you add a media, uh, the media will be added. For example, the one I remove will be added uh, with the, the title, with the title, with the co the, the current layout. Uh, uh, with uh, its own title as you can see now I started it's a, and uh, uh, automatically the um, custom title will be a play so in the new uh, stream you um, add you will see the title let's uh, for example use uh, uh, this one uh, you will see I will have Alibaba and uh, Alibaba will have this one okay that's all hope that uh, hope you will enjoy this new feature have a good day. Bye-bye.